So this question starts off by providing us with the function. We have p of t is equal to 1800 times 1 1.02 to the t power. The question goes on to say the function p gives the estimated number of marine mammals in a certain area where t is the number of years since a study began. Okay, so marine animals and years. Uh, what is the best interpretation of P of zero equals 1800? Well, zero is replacing T from our original function. We were told that T is the number of years since the study began. So if there have been zero years since the study has begun, that means we're just beginning the study, right? So at the very start of the study, we have this value of 1800. Well, what does that value represent? Well, that's the P value. And we're told again that P is the estimated number of marine mammals. So in essence, at the start of the study, there were 1800 marine mammals. So that's, that's the interpretation. So I like to take a time just to make sure I understand what's going on before I read the answer choices, because sometimes the wording of the answer choices can be a little tricky or partially correct. So just taking that moment to make sure you understand is very helpful in choosing the correct answer. So again, at the time of the study, or at the time of the start of the study, there were 1,800 mammals is what this P of zero equals 1,800 means. So let's look at choice A. So choice A says the estimated number of marine mammals in the area was 102 when the study began. Okay, so definitely not, it has nothing to do with 102. Um, choice B, the estimated number of marine mammals in the area was 1800 when the study began? Absolutely, right? I think B is definitely the correct answer. I'm gonna read the others, but I'm, I'm liking B quite a bit. Choice C, the estimated number of marine mammals in the area increased by 102 each year, right? So again, this question literally asks what P of zero equals 1800 means. So 102 is not even a part of that conversation. So that's completely out. Choice D, the estimated number of marine mammals in the area increased by 1800 each year. Note, the 1800 is a fixed number based upon what the number of marine mammals were at the start of the experiment. So I am pretty satisfied that choice B is the correct answer.